Hi, we're Jess and Carly, and together we're Kedu Carlo. We're going to show you some vocal processing techniques. We use an R song. Let's get to it. Here we have the lead vocal. Because of the nature of the song and the lyrics, we wanted to boost the feeling of unease and distrust using some fuzzy resonances on the high end, but we also wanted to maintain the organic tone of her voice so it still sounds soft and alluring. We're using a technique we call parallel distortion. It's the same process as parallel compression except we're using distortion effects instead. First we'll create a return channel and send 100% of the lead vocal to it. I'll start with a multi-band dynamics and solo the highs. Next we're going to pop a spectral resonator on. We'll put it on chorus and adjust the frequency and decay until we like how it sounds. Now we'll use spectral time. It's important to freeze it and set the interval as low as possible. That's what gives it clarity. We'll put the delay on time mode so we can be quite specific. Cool, happy. Now we'll adjust the return channel volume meter to determine the blend of the raw vocal and the parallel distortion. Using this method to blend the raw and wet signal in our vocals helps us to create an effect that feels processed but still natural at the same time. Yes, 